Hi, I'm Daryl Moon, a foreman with uh, Critical Electric Systems Group. Um, I really appreciate Turner implementing the Project Safety Leadership Council out here. Um, Josh Erickson uh, came up with the idea and it's a great idea. It's really changed the uh, overall safety culture out here. The safety culture before was great, uh, but we had three uh, safety incidents at the very beginning of the project and uh, there just wasn't full engagement and leadership from the foreman of every trade and a safety aspect. So uh, we implemented the project Safety Leadership Council. Um, and what that is, is um, we have a safety commissioner that we change every six months, um, which is voted on by the peers uh, from all the subs. And it's a, it's a subcontractor led committee and we have a meeting um, once every other week and uh, we get together and go over the safety concerns on the, on the project. Um, every morning we do a stretch and flex, job site wide, all the trades are there, all the subs and their uh, employees are there. Um, we stretch and then we talk about the safety hazards that are gonna be presented from each trade that day on the job site. So everybody's aware of what's going on um, and the possible hazards of the different areas that they may enter. Um, we'd fill out pretest plans every day. Um, that's not always the foreman. We get our guys engaged, we get the crew engaged so that they're aware of the hazards and they can start noticing things like that. Um, each trade turns in at least one SWAT card every week, which is also the crew. It's not always just the foreman. Um, typically we designate a different guy every week to turn those in so that again, we keep the guys fully engaged so that they're aware of the safety hazards on the job. Um, again, the Project Safety Leadership Council has brought all the subs together um, you know, we're instead of just being the brothers from your trade, now it, it feels like every trade there's a brotherhood out here. Um, we're all watching each other's back, um, we're all our brother's keeper, and making sure that we're going home safe to our families at the end of every day. So, I think the Project Safety Leadership Council has done a great job engaging everybody and bringing everybody together and um, keeping, a, keeping safety at the front of our minds instead of in the back of our minds. Eisenhower Medical Center. Uh, we're at, having the safety council meeting. Uh, does anybody have a life moment? Yeah, I got one to share. I was working for Pan Pacific over at the Annenberg Pavilion. I was doing seismic. I was using a rotor hammer and had to crawl up on some duct work, so I put a right angle attachment on. I crawled up on the duct, put the drill up there, and I was pulling myself up, and the electricians had a stiffy rod up there, and it fell right inside the trigger frame, and it turned on the drill motor. Well, that head rotated with the bit, and it grabbed my beard. I had a beard down to about here. It was a lot shorter afterwards, but it grabbed it, and it yanked it right out of the bottom of my neck here. So uh, I was bleeding everywhere. Took a rag and put it over there and hopped down. Went to the doctor and got it looked at, and uh, they said if it had been, I guess, two, me two millimeters deeper, I would have nailed the artery. And uh, yeah, it was it was a great life moment for me. Lesson learned from it was, uh, you know, be more aware of what was up there because uh, I'd been doing seismic for probably three months straight, and it's gotten the habit of just climbing up there, drilling, getting down, moving on. wasn't really paying attention to the surrounds at all, but yeah, that was uh, that was my life moment.
Never grew a beard after that. <laughs> no more long hair. <laughs> That's, don't get complacent, right? I do it for play. Hard work, work. Hard work. I earn my pay. Hard work, work. Hard work. We're on the go. Hard work, work. David Godoy, and I'm an iron worker with Washington Iron. Uh, being part of this Turner job has been quite the experience for me. Um, out here, regardless of what trade you're from, uh, we look out for each other's back. Um, having the safety council started out here, I know that my peers care for my well-being, but not only that, I know that Turner cares for my well-being. Uh, having gotten hurt out here September 25th, um, I know that firsthand. Uh, both uh, Josh and Dave out here were there for me throughout my recovery and were always available to me whenever I had any questions for them. Um, out here, working together is, is, uh, has been taken to a whole new level. I know that firsthand because all the trades work together to get the job done safely. Uh, having been recognized by my peers and nominated for the Life Award and actually winning the award, I made this uh, job to remember.